What's up, Clutch Nation? King Clutch 9000 with a video with. Happy Flat Day. We're trying to stay quiet because it's nighttime. It's literally midnight right now. So we're just doing like a late night video since we forgot we were doing the live stream. Giving out candy. We didn't have time to do this video. So we are literally doing this at freaking midnight right now. As y'all can see by the title, we're doing like our top 20 get scary or horror games that we want to play this year or next year or in the future where we want to play these. Like these are pretty scary games. So before we start telling you the list, make sure you hit that like button, comment down below. What's the most scariest game you had ever played in your life? PlayStation 2, Dreamcast, Sega Genesis, uh, PS4, Xbox One, Switch, all that stuff. You choose all that and make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel. I'm trying to hit 700 subscribers and also subscribe to Hot McFly's channel. And comment down below, this is what I was pointing to. Yep. Coming down below. And also hit that notification bell to get all notifications to all my future videos that will happen on this channel. So y'all can be the first one to watch all my videos. And I'm hoping y'all have awesome Halloween about the time y'all watching this the next day. Which is now Friday instead of Thursday. So I hope you guys... Then lose all your cheap from all the Halloween candy y'all had. If you're old enough, then you're safe. If you have braces, I'm sorry. Yep, I got braces so I can't eat candy. I gotta have these on for two freaking years. Yep. So let's, let's go ahead and get started with the list. <laughs> and also, comment down below, what did you dress up? With me, I was the Universal Champion and he was the Ultimate Spider-Man. I am the Universal Champion. I'm also the United States Champion. I'm just saying that because I have the title belt. So let's go ahead and get started. The first one on the list is Resident Evil Origins Collection, which has Resident Evil 1 without Leon and Resident Evil 3 without Leon. Right, so I haven't played them yet, though. We haven't been playing those yet, but. We really do want to play that. He's been playing the Resident Evil series. If y'all check out his live streams about Resident Evil 5 and 6, go check those out. He's going to be starting them back up. Yeah, I only got, like, I think, three chapters left. Yep. Then I got to beat the other one because I got, like, a whole chapter to do on that. Oh, yeah. So, I haven't gotten Resident Evil yet. Because of my mom, she, she's not a big fan of Resident Evil and she won't come in a room with, and re, I'm playing Resident Evil. But I'm hoping to get that. Next up, Resident Evil 2, the, re, the remake. Which starts off with Leon's story of how he started in Resident Evil, the rest of Resident Evil. So I haven't played it, but I always want to play it. I saw all our streamers play it he has two so we are ready to play that game and we're both going to get that arm challenge but we won't tell you what's the challenge until November 28th and that's a long way isn't it but November will be here today today is November 1st this is godly. I need to check out this video. Oh, yeah. About the time you see this, it's probably already November. So, that's awesome. Resident Evil 2, it's definitely uh, on my top list I'm going to get. Resident Evil Revelations. There's a first one and there's a second one. Both of those are the same Resident Evil, but they're a little oh, bit I different. I played that one. I played Revelation because you like. At this like don't want to spoil it. Hey, I ain't spoiling it. We we probably have some people <laughs> I haven't even played it yet. So I will say one thing, I ain't gonna spoil 
spoil it though, but you is in this like prison, so it's pretty fun. Yeah. Both those games is one <laughs> and two, so there's a part one of the story and there's a part two of the story, so make sure you get both games and you want the full story. Resident Evil 4, which is going on a little bit older, which I'm definitely going to get. So is he. We both like Resident Evil. Resident Evil 5, 6, and 7, we're definitely going to get. He uh, has bad, bad, 5 six. and 6. I still need to get them, but he doesn't have 7. But I really want to play in VR, which everyone's saying is like the most scariest parts <laughs> about Especially if you play in the dark, you don't really get paranoid. Oh yeah, this is all Xbox One, PS4. If y'all want to do a part two of it, uh, like the PS2, Xbox, Dreamcast, all those games, comment down below if you want to do that a part two. So Friday the Thirteenth, that's definitely a game I really want to get. That's so I can play with our streamers. But well, yeah, it's pretty dope. I love the movie too. It was awesome. I don't watch scary movies, but I yeah, do like yeah. scary games. That's weird. Until <laughs> Dawn, which what they're saying is that actually a pretty scary game. Cute. Which I will try my best to not run out of the room in the first chapter. <laughs> like she. We're like, ooh, that's fun. <laughs> but Dead by Daylight, oh, that is an awesome game. But you have to play online with four other people that have to be the live people while you're being the monster. Trying to hang on the hook. Oh, that's, that's how the game it. is. It's fun, but with him, if he finds me and he's the monster, yeah, I'm game for <laughs> Gee, it was funny when I saw Fat and Girl get hooked on there. <laughs> hey, Fat and Girl, I'm, I'm sorry. I wouldn't be mean to you. <laughs> and just you got hooked and I started laughing. So you really hooked me in. I know that you don't get the joke, but I just said it to be funny. Alien Isolation. That's pretty scary because you have no idea where the aliens are at at all. And it's like the most scariest game while I've been hearing from people. But the evil within, I will not, I'll stay away from that game because, <laughs> yeah, it's really that scary for me. But like, he'll play it and do a lot of shame for y'all. And there's a second one, so if y'all want him to do live streams, go kind on his live stream and go like, do this live stream. Blow his comment section out of the water. Of yeah, all the live streams, y'all. You know. Blow it out of the ocean and then make all the dolphins make noise. <laughs> <laughs> then next up, Dying Light, which is another game which has a second one coming out this year or next year, which you're parkouring but you're killing zombies. But it's weird. almost like Last of Us, but with parkour. And you're like the infected person, but mm -hmm. you're still immune to it. This sounds pretty weird. But the most scariest game of all time is this series, the Outlast Trinity mm -hmm. series. Like it comes with all three games, it's it's like that scary. Scarier evil within, scary than Silent Hill. <laughs> Silent Hill was the best. That man with that chainsaw really did a good job. But it's more scary than that. That's why I'm telling you to get one of these. Shoot, and chainsaw? That's really scary because that freaking shell of that man with them uh, needles in his head. I don't. That move. Don't. No, 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 no. No. Don't talk about that. I don't need that in my dreams. Because that man ate paper and he threw it up into the freaking sink and then uh, he made the. Other man stop, 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 <laughs> stop. Please, stop, or I am not going <laughs> to sleep tonight. No, it was nasty. No, the doctor. Uh, I can't eat that later. No. <laughs> Next up, Alan Wake, which is a pretty scary game, what they're saying. 
five and play his only 360, but I know it will come out on Xbox One. I know it will remaster on that. Dead Space, I haven't heard of that before. Man, that game sounds like it needs a lot of space. <laughs> the thing about what it was made. Hey. He's talking about my dog as you see her tail and her butt right there. But the final game though is the 20th game is Last of Us. Part 1 and Part 2 which is coming out next year. In uh, March. Yeah. It was pretty good. I get a rating of 10. I saw this is actually an awesome game. I played the first one so many times. But I can't wait until part two, so he has to get Last of Us, which he will definitely get and do a live stream just for y'all. Like, I was kind of thinking about getting the Walking Dead game that you showed me about. That looked yeah. pretty good because of, cause of like the series. Because when Glenn died on the TV show, I was Don't so sad. Spoil anything. Uh, people was, like, haven't watched the Walking Dead series. It was the old season that. Not the new one. But if you had new <laughs> viewers want to watch The Walking Dead, you just spoil it. No. Oh, my bad, yeah. Just skip that part. I can't edit it out because I suck at it now. Hmm. For some reason, I used to be good at editing, and now I suck at it. Man, I'm getting but a lot better at it. That's all the games. If y'all like The Walking Dead, the game stays. The actual Netflix series, leave a like. If you want one of us to do the live stream, if he can teach me how to do the live stream, I'll definitely do that for y'all and definitely do a lot of gameplay for y'all on my channel. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you guys have awesome Halloween and get ready for the upcoming video. Of us doing a big boy bow when we wake up. So I'll see you guys in the morning or in the afternoon. Peace out. Peace.